Now, coming into cost, right? How do you set this up? So we do, the first thing you can do is there is an OCR estimator. The OCR estimator is in preview today and it can, you can't run it actually once OCR has been enabled. So what you can do is you actually have to go into purview to run the OCR estimator. You actually go into purview, you go into the settings and purview and you click OCR. And if you're there for the first time, you'll see a try for free action in there and it will let you run a scan in your organization to see what the estimated OCR cost would be based on a set amount of time. And you can run that and download that report. Now, setting this up, this is set up as part of the Microsoft 365 pay-as-you-go services. The unique part about OCR for this setup is that you, you are able to pick the specific SharePoint and OneDrive sites that you want OCR to be enabled. So if you want to validate this or you're worried about cost and you have a lot of stale data, you don't always you don't need to set this up for your entire tenant. You could pick specific SharePoint sites that are important to you or that have potentially risky data that you want to have OCR on, and you can filter that based on CSV. So I can take a CSV, upload it, and manage that through, through a file. Uh, there's no dynamic way to do that. You have to maintain it yourself. Uh, but if you do want to control cost or pilot this out, you can enable it, but then focus it down to a subset of sites. You cannot do a subset of like teams and, and okay. you know, right? So you can have very SharePoint-specific locations, and then the rest is going to be enabled.